Hello everyone, uh, I am ESA Marif, you know that, uh, your host, uh, Photoshop, Illustrator and Blight Tool. Now you know I have a channel on uh, YouTube. Today I am going to show you how to just uh, capture the cityscape and uh, edit this type of photos on a Photoshop. Okay, uh, at first I will take photo and uh, then I will show you to the Photoshop uh, how to just uh, mm, uh, process this one. Uh, okay, uh, thank you. Uh, at first uh, I am taking some pictures. Uh, I'm using a Nikon camera, uh, which is uh, 5100, this one, 5100, and the lens is 10 to 24, that is Tamron uh, SP1024. Uh, you can uh, just uh, get this lens on uh, Amazon on a second hand, and you can uh, get it uh, brand new on a Nikon shop, or any kind of camera shop, you will just uh, get it. Uh, the approx amount will be uh, 484 USD. Uh, if you just buy, uh, want to buy the second hand from the Amazon, uh, it will take um, uh, 248 or 282 um, USD. At first, uh, I will select the photo uh, which uh, I want to edit. Uh, this one, landscape. This one, no, overexposed. Uh, underexposed. Another shot. The framing is taken. then here's some lights uh, i can eat this one okay i'm selecting this photo yeah this one the number is 8485 8485 or no i can get this photo mm or this one this one is the best i think okay i'm just dragging and dropping this one it will take time okay first one camera row filter adding some lights contrast highlight i will just reduce the highlighted and tint temperature and tint shadow I will add shadow blackish white in plenty I'll increase the clarity saturation variance and open image okay now I'll make a copy of this photo and now I'll work with it. Gradient map. Okay. The blending mode overlay. Get. And then color lookup. I'll give the horror blue color. I'll reduce the opacity. okay then I am decreasing the fill and increasing the opacity like that and then take a new layer I'll give the color from here I'm just adjusting the size of blending mode screen. Now I'll make a group and merge all the layers by pressing Ctrl Shift Alter E. And now I will open this photo on a camera raw filter. Exposure. Highlights. Why I will uh, like a dreamy effect. That's why I just added this one. And now I will go to generated filter. 
okay I'm changing the color of the sky the blue sky actually okay then I'm going to amount of detail okay now I'm in a curves the blue curves I will just do something yes the green curves no no yes that's good I think that's good okay now red curves okay a little bit now the color hue saturation and luminance hue this is the hue the orange hue saturation orange saturation luminance the yellow okay the green no the aqua aqua no yes this one is good blue saturation I will add some saturation from blue a little bit okay that's enough I think this one is the before and now this one is the after and now I'll add some levels I want to make it more dramatic that's why I'm adding this this effect this thing okay another thing I'll go or add some reddish or blue type and this one make it more okay make it screen reduce that that's good now I'll go and take a new layer and add some white color here okay vivid color add some brightness and contrast actually contrast reduce the light contrast uh, that is enough and now gradient map add another gradient make it screen reduce okay go to exposure and I'm adding here 17 57 and 0.8 so, that's good and now I'm giving the brightness and contrast uh, I want to increase some brightness there is some contrast Mm, no, okay. it's okay. I'm making group all the things and pressing Control Shift Alter E for making a merge the group camera filter. Go to go to going to camera filter and I will reduce the saturation of the yellow. Yellowish. This one is the orange orange thing. That's okay. Okay, now going to brightness and contrast five and eight. Okay, final image is done. Uh, now 
this one was the before and this is after if I want to reduce the blue one uh, I have to go filter camera filter in this one I'll reduce some blue from here yeah that's good it's nice I think thank you okay uh, thank you so much uh, for the watching my video and uh, uh, special thanks to Antar Mashud because this rooftop is uh, his rooftop and that's why uh, he'll get some treat from me and uh, Antar Mashud I want to tell something please and thank you so much for watching our videos and don't forget to like comment share every social media and don't forget to subscribe thank you, thank you. peace